for you. Here are the top plays. Number two. Number one. The Heat entered halftime with a solid lead. Clearly, the number of three-pointers these guys scored in the first half was incredible. And if they can keep that up, it's going to be tough to keep that team down. Have a look at the leading scores for the Miami Heat. The Cavaliers were unable to find an offensive flow in the opening half. They've been scrappy, doing their best to be competitive. We'll see if their efforts are more rewarded in the second half. These are the guys getting buckets for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Game track. Points in the paint. The Cleveland Cavaliers have been too soft once the opposition has gotten the ball into the paint. Even worse, they refuse to tighten up and make a difference about it. They allow most of those interior points in the opening quarter. The first half stat tell a bit more of the story. Player of the half. Goran Dragic really showed off his court vision in the first half. When he's able to get the ball moving like that, his team can be tough to stop. And here we have a look at the stats. And that concludes our halftime report. Thanks for joining us. And see you again after the game. I got ball. I got ball. Let's go. Gets to the rim. Rebound handled by Winslow. He fires it the length of the floor. Dragic is trying to get free off the pick. Passes it back to him. It's a loose ball. Richardson's pass nearly stolen. They double him. It's a loose ball. Goes out of bounds. So it'll be heat ball. Well, up to this point, Jeff, we've been seeing plenty of positives from both of these teams. I don't know what to say, but both teams are in fuego from the three-point line. You're watching absolute great shooting by both teams. Down into the lane. There's a steal. Dragic draws the double. Ball comes loose. Crowder playing inside out. From the corner, a three-pointer. Oh, in and out. Oh, he swats it. Pass intercepted by Winslow. One of the keys to winning in this league is not beating yourself. Both teams seem determined to beat themselves rather than their opponent. It's a loose ball. The ball travels straight out of bounds. And Goran Dragic will get the inbound. We're down to nine seconds on the shot clock. Nice pass. Throws it down. What a play. You just got to keep playing the game. Push the ball in transition. Get it to the rim. Good finish. Hey, you've got a big mountain to overcome with this deficit. But you're just trying to win each and every possession. Ouch. Takes a pass to the head. Gives up on the shot and passes it out. Puts it in and draws the foul. Time for the free throw for a chance at a three-point play. That's great body control right there. Finishes the shot and now goes to the free throw line. I got Strong rebound by James. To the rim. Nice move adjusting for two. You got to get your guys down the floor in transition quicker than they can get back. 
If you can rebound it and then get it up the floor, you're going to have numbers to exploit the basket opportunities. Attack the rim. Don't settle for jumpers. Finish strong. Tied up, has to make that pass. Oh, a ferocious dunk. I don't know about you, but that's why I watch NBA basketball, to see guys drive and attack off the dribble and then throw it down. Off the backboard for two. Your mama never said it was gonna be easy. Attack the basket. You guys got yourself in this hole, this big deficit. You gotta work your way out of it. You do it by going at the rim. Nice inside pass. And the paint scores the basket following that perfect entry pass. The ball movement in this game has been phenomenal, forcing a lot of defensive rotations and ultimately a lot of passes leading to direct scores. Chance of a three-point play. It's good. And one. And the foul is called against James. Absorbs the contact, finishes the shot, and now works his way to the free throw line. Great board work on the offensive boards. Just won't go from point blank range. Tied up and has to pass. The Heat with fantastic follow. What a putback. Attack the basket time and time and time again, and you will be rewarded. Here, good finish, which adds to their lead. A big margin right now in the second half. And Miami's called for the foul. Their first team foul. I really like what I saw there. Good strength, good athleticism. Took the foul, got up a nice shot, just didn't roll in. Goes two for two at the line. Three minutes gone by in the third. The Cavs down by 11. To Dragic. Oh, he threw it out of bounds. Jeff, we've been treated to some terrific action so far in this game. The Heat get the inbound. Uses a screen to the basket. It's good. Over two defenders. What more could the defense have done, Mike? They had him double teamed, and he still managed to get off the shot. Kicks it out to the corner. Crowder. Seven seconds remaining on the 24. There's the double team. Ball comes loose. Just got his fingertips on that pass. To wait. Spinning inside. To the rim. See that spin move? Outstanding body control and then the ability to still finish and concentrate on sometimes mesmerized by what these athletes can do. Excellent feed. Throws it down. You've got small on big inside. Attack the mismatch and try to dunk it right on top of their head. I got him, I got him. Into the front court. Desperate for some points. Excellent ball movement around the perimeter. And he nails it. A long two. And here's another look at it. Whistle blows. Timeout called here as we wind down the third quarter. That's just tremendous defensive effort. You did all you could to prevent the make. Unfortunately, he stuck it. Some substitution is going to be made now for the team. Putting him on skates. Gets past the defense. Nice. And Goran Dragic with the bucket. Again, that's another example of quality NBA offense. Moving the ball, searching the open man out, and then finally knocking it in.
to James. Inside, puts it in off the glass on a nice feed from Dwayne Wade. Sometimes the simplest plays are the hardest ones to execute. Good layup. Dragic on the drive, lets it go. Nice touch at the basket. Lazy pass and a turnover. And as we wind down the quarter, he just fires it up. Third quarter comes to an end. Fourth quarter coming up. Cleveland's down by 15. We'll be right back with more Wednesday night basketball here on ESPN after the break. Fourth quarter is set to begin. Jeff, this game's not over yet, but what has to change for them to pull off this comeback? Well, it starts with creating some fast break opportunities off of great defense. They've got to get some steals, some fast breaks, get some momentum, and get some excitement back in their game. They have no excitement in their game. They've got to string together some buckets. Shoots it for two. And LeBron James with his fifth rebound. Terrific feed. Goes to the goal. Off the glass. I love when teams share the ball. You learn everything you needed to know in this world in kindergarten. And the number one thing that Mrs. French taught me was share. And I'll tell you what, they are sharing the basketball here today in this game. And here's the replay with another look at that tremendous play. And here's the double. Oh, excellent screen. Turnover on the pass. This is an absolute joke, the way both of these teams are turning the ball over. Count it, and the foul called against Dragic. And he'll get to shoot a free throw tonight for the first time in the game as he tries to complete the three-point play. That's big-time play right there. Finishing the shot through the contact and now goes to the free throw line. using the screen trying to get free oh that pass nearly picked off and he throws it down continue to pick him apart in the pick and roll pick roll catch finish it's a loose ball and they come up with a turnover at the rim unable to flip it in great off oh that's a devastating dunk in his face inside for the layup Ooh, this is the inside shot no paint game no winning you've got to get the ball at the basket and then you've got to finish when you get it there he's been red hot he's averaging 17 points per game this season I got him. I got ball. I got ball. shut down forced to make the pass He curls, gets it off, that's a two-pointer. Oh, he knocks it down. You're not gonna see a better possession in the NBA from both sides of the ball. Good defense, good offense, good offense one out that time. That's good, 14-point lead for the Heat. And as this game has gone on and progressed, they have become more and more efficient offensively here in the second half. Absolutely dynamic offense. 
James for two, shoots away. James misfires again. Cleveland hoping to stop this run and stop it now. The screen is set. Looks to put it back up again. And a nice finish at the basket. That's a 10 to two run for the Heat. A pretty entry pass to the rim. Tries to back it, won't go. Driving the ball into the paint is the most important offensive tool in the game. He had a great look, he just missed it. To Haslam, looking to curl in. Haslam off the glass for two. Hey, can you say blowout? Is it gonna change? Not with this defense. Gets to the rim, and it rolls in. An 8-0 run for the Heat. Three and a half gone by in the fourth. Cleveland's down by 20. And that's his seventh rebound of the game. He loses control of it. Oh, he gets the steal. Crowder from outside, a three-pointer. In and out. White side. Oh, that's a get out of my way of throwing it down. And here's the replay with another look at that spectacular dunk. What a crowd pleaser. That's it. They can start warming the bus up because this one is over. Smith on the drive, adjusting on the shot. This is at the rim. Hey, they've had some good looks, but not enough of them. Solid defense, and then the ones they have had, they haven't been able to convert. Forced to make the pass. Haslam, smart adjustment for the shot, and gets it to go. Look, you can't give up layups like that. You gotta protect the basket and the paint at all costs. Pulls up. Can't get it to fall. Half a minute remains in the game. Cleveland's down by 24. Tied up, has to make that pass. Double team closing in. Tied up and has to pass. Moves around the defender to the basket. Flips it up, straight down the middle. He puts it in. Smith, Cleveland's got to be disappointed with how this game turned out. Tough loss for them here today. And this one ends here. The final score is 73 to 47. For Jeff Van Gundy and our entire EA Sports crew, this is Mike Green saying thanks for watching. Game wrap up. The Heat put on a show in a blowout. The scoring display they put on is going to be hard to forget. It's hard to imagine anyone doesn't come away impressed with how effectively they score their points. What you see here is how the majority of the points were scored for the Miami Heat. The Cavaliers are no longer suffering through what was a big time blowout. And it's games like this where veteran players can be so important. They've been through these types of blowouts and they know what it takes to keep a locker room united. What you see here is how the majority of the points were scored for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Game track, steals. And now, of course, the game stats. Player of the game. Being able to put up these kind of numbers is always impressive, but having the ability to lead and inspire 
is something special. Who was cold? What can you say about a guy like this? Except that he fits the title of this segment. He was definitely cold in this game. Here's our top plays of the game. Number two. The Heat could not have been more dominant in this game. And that does it for our post-game wrap-up. On behalf of ESPN on EA Sports, I'm Jalen Rose. Thanks for joining us.